The audience clapped, listened, and run with intent as people showed up to hear the powerful forms of language, such as music, literature, art, and even photography that were on display by students at the Intercultural Center at the unveiling of Cul-de-Sac. Cul-de-Sac is a literary and arts magazine that is published annually by students from English 122 at College of the Canyons. This year marks the 17th edition of the magazine and one that the magazine's advisor says is one of the most fulfilling editions yet. I think, I hope somebody comes, you know, look at this room, it was full of people today cheering on their family, cheering on their students. The English department showed up um, en masse to cheer us on, to cheer the magazine on. Um, it has been honestly the most glorifying part of my career. I Dr. Aileen has been hosting this since its inception and has one main reason for doing so. Magazine um, is about inclusivity, it's about belonging, it's about diversity, it's about highlighting the voices of students who often are voiceless um, or who often feel silenced. And that's what, that's what my why is. I want their voices to be heard. At this unveiling, there was also awards being given out to students with the most creative writing. And one student, struggling to find his voice, may have found it as he won an award for his fiction, Silicone Him. It was pretty great. This is the, this is the first ever um, event or gathering uh, that I've been to for anything like this. Uh, this is also the first time I have, I've had any of my work published, which is very exciting. Um, being in, uh, uh, doing the introduction to creative writing class at, at COC here has been uh, really helpful so far in me learning the craft of storytelling. If you want to publish any of your artwork, please contact aileen.tazurian at canyons.edu. The 18th edition is set to be released next year. For Candy's News, I'm Julian Osorio.